in 08, I had to move because mm. all that shit that happened to me. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Where does I, I literally, like, overnight, I had to move. Yeah. Um, Use the Google. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at the images. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, basically, um, I'll have a little bit more. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, actually, that's good. Okay. I'm good. Um, I chose LA because LA, there was space. So mm -hmm. on my plate, yeah. where I knew people and I could kind of integrate mm -hmm. was Tokyo, yeah. New York, London, or Los Angeles, mm -hmm. right? And I had spent so much time in Hong Kong, this brick concrete jungle. Yeah. I felt like California might be good for me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, you know, mm -hmm. like open space and- Escape from Hong Kong type yeah. shit. Yeah, 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 you know, and be in a total different kind of environment so I don't feel reminded, oh, this, oh, I remember this corner or this thing or this thing, you know? Mm -hmm. It's like totally foreign, right? Mm -hmm. And I grew up in Vancouver. So it kind of has some Vancouver vibes. Yeah, I didn't. I couldn't go to Vancouver because there's too many Chinese people there, <laughs> and it would have been a nightmare. Mm -hmm. So I came to LA, and why did I stay? Um, I stayed. You know, I th I'd say half because of the people. Yeah, yeah. And then half because LA has changed a lot ever since '08. I mean, yeah. you know, um, with marijuana being legalized, mm. came a wave of culture and lifestyle stuff. So restaurants, gallery, like small little galleries, like, you know, stuff like that, that was like, made your life a little better. Even though it wasn't like yours, mm -hmm. like, you know, like you felt like, oh, there's more things to go out to instead of some, some Hollywood shits, you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And no disrespect to the Hollywood shits, but you have to have a variety, man, you know? You have to have a variety. And I felt like when I first came here, it was hard for me to find something that I wanted to eat. And I'd say like, really like, this restaurant is ill. And maybe it's because I didn't know, enough places but i feel like from like 2010 to 2018 there's like this crazy explosion no there know? is what yo that's interesting too because like i feel like it kind of started in some ways with like animal you know what i mean like they ushered in like quite a different generation of chefs but son like of a gun you, the same the same mm -hmm. yeah that was around yeah. that time too you know so animal was impossible to get to best mm -hmm. son animal. of a gun yes, yeah 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 you know and it was like oh god you know yeah like, but like for you, what were the restaurants that made it like, oh shit, I like being here now, that now the food scene is ill? I mean, uh, not for nothing, I love John and Vinny's. Mm -hmm. I love John and Vinny's, easy. I love the pizza. Mm -hmm. I used to like going down to Fairfax and just chilling with the Prem crew and just like, yeah. you know, talking shit, yeah. being on the block. But even before then, right? Like, cause you, oh, hey, you're saying 2010, like what were the restaurants in 2010? Like, Motherfucker, I wasn't going nowhere, bro. I was like hiding out, man. Yeah. I was like, you know, Johnny Rockets up in there every day. <laughs> Really? Yo, I live right off oh, Melrose yeah, you in the hood. You can't go to SGV. You yeah. can't go eat Chinese no, food. No, no. So what's funny is, is that when I first came back, I was craving iced lemon tea mm. and bubble waffles. Mm. Okay. So my friend was like, yo, I'm going to bring you, I'm going to bring you. It's a little while yeah. out, right? But there's a lot of Chinese people. So yeah. get ready. Yeah. I hadn't seen a Chinese motherfucker in months, man. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? It felt like, you know? So it, we went there, walked into this restaurant and the whole restaurant just silence right like wow like this yeah. right? in a chinese restaurant what yeah. restaurant was it i forgot man Word. um so i'm like oh, this like, is my homegirl uh, grace i'm like grace yo this is not cool man and she's like okay let's just eat and go let's just eat and go I'm like, okay okay we sit down within three minutes our table's full of plates oh shit. on the house right not one thing i eat <laughs> you know what i mean and i'm You're feeling like, so bad so i'm like man am i really gonna have to order on top of this because i oh. feel bad you know and then I I I I I I I didn't go back for months. 